am karma. Karma's world is all about a middle school girl who is an aspiring rapper and she wants to change the world for the better through her music. Karma's world is about a brilliant, intelligent, beautiful young black girl who has big dreams with a big heart and has plans to make the world a better place. And not only to do that through her music, but to also do it by becoming a better person each and every day. What I want parents and kids to take away from this show is that it is okay to have a path that is not necessarily traditional, not a doctor or a nurse or a teacher. Like there's other things out there that you can pursue and do that might seem very difficult to get to, but it is possible. And I think that you should continue to um, support that and, and put love behind that. Earth to karma. Let me guess. Lost in your own personal music video. <laughs> hey, karma. Karma? Huh? What does that even mean? It means if you put out love, you'll get love back. Girl. My dream is to be a rapper and change the world with my music. Girls can't be real rappers. Has anyone ever told you that you can't do something? Girls can be anything they want, right? Let me show you what I mean. We're ready. Let's do it. The inspiration behind the series was my oldest daughter. Her name is Karma, um, and she used to come into my studio my home studio where I recorded all of my music and she would constantly barge in and interrupt me and say she wanted to rap too. And you know, after about the third or fourth time that she kept doing it, it was very consistent. I sat her down and had a conversation with her and told her, if you want to do music, you have to talk about what goes on in your world because daddy talks about what goes on in his world. Even though karma is my namesake, I actually see karma as representing all young black girls because there's a piece of her that I feel we can all relate to. All of us being represented, regardless of age, regardless of economic status on Karma's world, shows who we are in this world and who we can be if we just open our eyes and open our hearts to our neighbor. We draw from real life inspirations. They are very, very similar. The self-confidence issues and some of the things that Karma went through during her you know, um, adolescent years are some of the storylines that go on in this show. I remember being in the car in the back seat and my dad asking me, like, if you, if you had a website and you were singing songs, you know, about um, things in your life, what type of things would you sing songs about? And I told him all these different ideas, what I would sing about. I told him about how, you know, school wasn't always um, easy for me and if I sang songs about things that I learned in school then it would be easier for me to learn them and to take them in and so now seeing how far Karma's world has come I always think about the day that it was just an idea because I feel like that's where dreams begin and now it's just come so so far just from the website, from creating these songs about education and about different things I had learned in school, and then uh, into a cartoon, seeing the cartoons in black and white, and then in color, and then with added music. Like, it's just, it's all about the journey that I see right now, because, you know, now that we've finally made it, it's, it's the journey that really surprises me. I think the best shows come when you draw inspiration from real life. It's a beautiful day up in my neighborhood. I'm with my smelly brother Keith, but I'm feeling good. Let's sell for limited time. It's the toilet paper helmet 3000. <laughs> <Whoa. Ooh. gasps> I'm okay. Swiveling thoughts on my words past the margin. Switches on the beat and Miss Washington's in her garden. And I'm so real that nothing is superficial. Headed to my school that's called Peach Tree Middle. My friends ask me a million questions about my hair. You come from a long line of black women with beautiful hair, especially me. <laughs> the thing that makes us all different is our superpower. And if somebody disagrees, you have to say it louder. My hair's unique and I love my curls, so put them up for afros all across the world. So, 
beautiful. 